Namaste. I'm here to tell you about something very interesting we are launching in just another week. But before that, let's roll back to the year 2005 when we started Zoho Schools. It was an experiment. Experimentation has always been a hallmark of what we do here at Zoho and Zoho Schools. What started as a very small experiment with a small group of students and a, an even smaller group of teachers grew. And uh, in the year 2017, we launched the Zoho School for Advanced Study. In 2018, we launched the Zoho School of Design. And in 2019, we launched the Zoho School of Business. Experimentation. Along the way, though, one thing that kept bothering us was this um, real uh, dissonance between, hey, inside Zoho schools, there are no exams. We do not conduct closed book timed tests to evaluate you. We use other methods. But to get into Zoho schools, we conduct these entrance tests and uh, mass recruitment, melas and all those things that happen typically in any college environment. We wanted to break that. We wanted to try and identify other ways, other less pressured ways of attracting the right talent. We kept looking for ideas. And in 2009, somebody by name Jake Parker had come up with an annual celebration of practicing the skill of drawing. He called it Inktober. And in the month of October, he launches one clue or one prompt a day for 31 days. And every day, people from around the world, you can see them here, they are all submissions for this particular prompt from around the world. They celebrate their skill. It's typically an inking job, but many people take other uh, liberties about it. We tried it a couple of years ago inside Zoho schools, and uh, the reception was very good. We thought, uh, why not allow applicants to try it too? And then we said, why stop with just art? Isn't writing an art of its own? Isn't coding an art of its own? Why not have a hacktober for programmers? Why not have a pentober for writers? Why only an inktober for artists? So last year, for the first time, we launched pentober, hacktober, and inktober in the month of October. And we said, do this very well, consistently, for 31 days. And we will call you based on the quality and consistency of your performance. We will call you for an interview directly. As many as 20 students joined us last year through this process. Motivated by the results, this year, once again, we are launching Hacktober, Pentober, Inktober, and wait, one more, Mathtober. If you like solving problems, if mathematics is the thing that stokes your imagination and pushes you passionately, that's what we want to see. So launching Hacktober, Pentober, Inktober, and Mathtober on October 1. All you need to do is visit this bit.ly URL, bit.ly slash Zestober. That's what we are calling it. Zest is basically an overflow of positive energy, enthusiasm. Isn't that what we want to evaluate in our students? And if you're the WhatsApping kind, please join us in this chat group, bit.ly slash zestchat. We'll wait for you there and hurry up. We don't have much time.